What's up, Tube? It's Dino West back in here with y'all. Hey, I got another shoe from y'all, my collection that I wanted to show y'all. It's another NMD. It's one of the very few that I have. I don't remember why, by heart, how many I got, but hey, let's get right into it. Let me check it out. Style code BB2363. All right. I know y'all looking at this crazy. This is actually a woman's exclusive shoe. Alright, check it out. This actually was a challenge for me because um I know that some of the shoes, some of the women exclusive shoes, they do extend to the male sizes. And um when I was first getting into like doing the shoe thing, um, I was looking into how I could go into the extended sizes and see if I could fit the shoes in the extended scale sizes. And this is a size 11. And um, so, in Jordans, it normally will be a 12 for me to fit in for a 10 and a half, but Adidas run bigger. So I was able to get away with 11, fit it like it was a, I want to say a nine and a half in Adidas. And usually the lowest I could, I could wear is a size 10. So yeah, I think for a male, this would be a nine and a half. If I'm mistaken, yeah. For a male, this would be a nine and a half. And I was able to fit in it with my lowest being a 10. But yeah, um, I actually haven't wore it, but I just thought it was a dope colorway. Um, it sold out pretty fast, so I thought I would have um, a nice little resale on it. Um, the retail was 170 and I saw it on StockX for 190 so the retail didn't do what I expected to do, but it's still a nice shoe. Um, it's a little bit too extra for me, too much for me. Um, there are shoes that are women exclusive that don't have like so pink, so much pink in it or something like that. It just be a little bit different colors or colors just exclusive for females. For some reason, uh, Jordan does that. And um, yeah, but this is one of them that's actually too much. I think I probably would end up doing a giveaway for these or giving it away to somebody. Still haven't decided yet. But yeah, um, just get into the shoe, get into the shoe. Um, when I first, I think these were originally nicknamed Sun, well, let me not even say the wrong thing, but it looked like a glitch, one of those glitch camo packs or glitch something packs, but um, I can't, I'm not sure about that, but this is actually a prime knit, this is actually a prime knit. NMD, unlike the other ones, they were knit, and because of that prime knit, is why I'm guessing it has an extra $40 added on to the tag. So these are 170 and the last ones that I had that I showed y'all was $130, so extra $40 for this prime knit. But let me get into the shoe for y'all. Pretty much, like all NMDs, the sock, pretty much the sock of the shoe, the foundation of the shoe, is pretty much... Prime knit, but it is um, rose pink, core black, and footwear white is what I got off the site. And um, this pretty much is pretty much you see detailed around the whole shoe. We have the three classic Adidas stripes. We have the sock liner that goes more of just the pink and the white strays away from the black around the uh, the sock liner of the shoe so yeah the pattern it changes all around the shoe you can see it changes a little bit more it's different all around the shoe pretty neat shoe um laces are black heel counter it's black. I 
like the last ones. The last ones which were like a um a leather full tab. This one is um I don't know. I don't know exactly what this material material is. I'm not really too good with that. Maybe cotton nylon. I, I have no idea. But you could tell it's a little bit looser and less firm as the one that was before the one I had on. So yeah, it's the full tab. The back of the shoe with the black heel counter. Of course, you know the boots. The boots come on the side. This, if you can see, is, is kind of a gray color. One of the parts is kind of gray. The black part in the back. On the inside, there's another black pod. Bottom of the shoe, majority black, uh, black outsole. Uh, a little pink, little pink part of this, the outsole right here. More of a hotter pink, I would say. It's pretty much the same pink as right here. Um, see the boost, insole, black insole, foot liner, matches the shoe. Foundation in the shoe, pink boost on the inside. So tell me what y'all think about this. Have y'all ever copped a pair of um, exclusives, women exclusive uh, colorway? Uh, tell me how y'all feel about that. Would you rock them? Um, yeah, y'all get into the comment box. Let me know. Like, comment, share. Let's build up the Dino Wesson film. Subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you can stay updated with the content. And as always, Dino Wesson, gone.